Good afternoon, everybody. How are we today? Happy, happy Wednesday. <laughs> Ooh, oh, I don't know about you guys, but I am worn out. But I managed to get most of the things done-ish that I needed to get done, hence why I'm on a little bit later. So if you can sprinkle me around, I would appreciate it. So just while I'm waiting for this to um, sink, just so that I can check everything is okay. Um, my name is Pauline Rogers and I am the face behind Beauty For You. So if you're catching me on the replay and you'll know it's the replay because you won't have that live at the top corner, then please come and say um, hi or hashtag newbie just so that I know that you have checked in. And if you can um, give me some love, uh, put a heart or a thumb just to let me know that you've checked in. And if you've not seen me before and this resonates with you or you enjoy it, then please press anywhere on the screen, press follow and to make sure notifications is on so that you can come and catch me live. And for all of those you, you are watching me live, then come and say hi. I love to chat and um, it's not much fun when you're on your own. So I've had a busy, busy day. Um, I didn't come live yesterday, but hopefully you all caught my video that I've done showing you the spray foundation covering up my tattoo. The spray foundation comes back on Friday, guys, so I have got a pre-order list going. So if you want to get on my pre-order list, then please put spray foundation down in the comments. And if you want to have a colour match, then put colour match in and I will colour match you as well. Because this baby flies off the shelf every time it comes um, back restocked. It flies off the shelf, especially the lighter shades. So if you're like me, quite uh, pale complexion, then you are going to want the lighter shades and these fly off the shelf the moment they become back in stock and they don't hang around for too long. So I don't want you guys to miss out. As I say, this baby comes live at 5 p.m. UK time, Friday uh, afternoon. I can queue up for you because there's going to be a queuing system on the website because there's going to be loads of us trying to get hold of this uh, foundation. So you've got choice. You can actually queue up if you want to. If you want to get it yourself, that's fine. But if you want me to order it for you, then let me know and I will queue up and do it on your behalf for you. So we're going to use the spray foundation. We're just going to do like a quick look because time has got away from me again. But before I do any uh, makeup, I just want to say thank you to everybody who sent me um, and my son birthday wishes yesterday. He had a fantastic day, hence why I didn't come live yesterday. Um, he's now a teenager, a bit stroppier today than <laughs> he was yesterday, teenager. Um, but no, he had a good day and he thanks everybody for giving him his uh, birthday wishes on my um, wall. That was really nice of you guys. So thank you on the behalf of my son and myself for all his lovely birthday wishes that made his day even more special being on lockdown. So again, thank you very much for that. Okay, so let's get on. So I'm going to use, I'm going to use my hydrating primer today because I just feel my skin needs a little bit more hydration. So I'm going to go on with the Hydrating Triumph Primer. Now, as I said, we are going to use the spray foundation because, again, I want to show you the coverage on the spray foundation, guys, because it is absolutely amazing how much it covers. If you saw that video of me doing the spray foundation on my arm, you saw how much it covered my tattoo up. It, the foundation I use is not actually the right shade for my arm because my arm is definitely a different colour to my face, obviously. Um, but you saw the coverage on this. I hope that showed you how good the coverage is on that uh, spray foundation, guys. It is absolutely the most lightest full cover mascara you are ever going to be able, to, ever going to wear. That is so good that you don't even know you got it on. So we're just going to let that do its awesomeness for a minute. So I've used the hydrating primer. So the hydro, so a primer. The spray foundation and the kabuki brush these are the three items that you want the most in your makeup kit because these are going to give you your foundation now i am quite warm in here the bedroom is quite you know this room is quite quite warm uh my now room well it used to be a bedroom but now my now now my office um is very warm in here because it's south facing uh window so it's getting all the sunlight and it's really warm in here so if I do look a bit flustered it's because it's very very warm in here I have got the window shut because obviously I have got a train that goes across right down the bottom of my garden and if that goes by it is like the clappers so I kept the window shut just to keep the noise minimum for you guys so let's get on with a quick 
face but as i said if you're catching me live come and say hi if you are not then please um if you watch me on the replay um as i said you won't have that live in the top corner then please come and put hashtag replay or hashtag hi or hashtag newbie if you've never spoken to me before so so i can come back and check in with you and say thank you for watching my live video because i do appreciate you guys and if you can sprinkle this video around i would appreciate even more because that helps me get my business out and you're supporting me by just getting my business out and if you put shared in the comments or sprinkled in the comments and i'll come back and talk to you and talk about setting up an affiliate link for you so that you can um hopefully bag yourself some free uh, product credit Okay, so we're going to go on with the spray fan. As I said, we're just going to do just a quick and light look because it is getting quite late in the day now. So I'm just going to use my spray foundation, give it a little shake, a couple of little squirts, open my trusty mirror up, and then I'm just going to start to pat it on. And hopefully, you guys can see the difference this foundation makes. Now, this is going to give you an absolute full coverage. It is going to cover all your blemishes up. If you've got a lot of redness on your face, it's going to cover up all the redness. And it is going to be so light that you are not even going to know you are wearing it. Look at the coverage so far, guys. It is absolutely amazing. So absolutely, I love it. And a couple more little squirts. As I said, I'm just going to do a light coverage. Um, you can obviously build on this and go darker if you want to, but I'm just going for a very light coverage today. But you've got to wear this and you're not even going to know you've got it on because it's so light. It smells absolutely divine. And as I said, this baby comes back in stock on Friday. So if you want to get on my pre-order list, then put spray foundation in the comments and I will get in your inbox and we will sort that out for you. If you need a colour match, then put colour match in and I can colour match you as well if you don't know what your shade is. But as you can see how quick and easy that was to give me a complete coverage. Now, because it gives me one coverage, I now look all one colour. <laughs> So we are going to put a little bit of colour back in our cheeks once we have blended this all in. But you can see how easy it blends. And with the Kabuki brush, guys, it really does go in really, really quickly. Like so. But see, that's covered. And it's now giving me complete flawless look so that's the spray foundation which goes really well with like a booty brush and any of our hydrations um face primers because it's a crime not to prime you can use our mattifying primer this one our hydrating primer or our regular uh glorious touch primer which is ideal for every skin type so if you need any help with that then just put a cup in the comments for me guys and i'll get back to you okay so i'm just going to put my eyebrows on i'm just going to use my eyeline um brow eyeliner again just to show you how quick and easy this is so all this is in stock everything else that i'm using apart from the uh, spray foundation because that doesn't come back until friday at 5 p.m uk time if you are watching me and you are in america or one of the other markets it may be in on your market so if you want to we can check to see if it's already in for you but it comes back on the uk market five o'clock on Friday. So I'm just going to put the quick and easy eyebrow on using my eyebrow liner. You can see how quick and easy that was to highlight my eyebrows where they are. Just like that. Okay. 
so that's a quick and easy way of putting your eyebrows on using our position eyebrow liner and you've got the spoolie on the end as i said which is really good for just brushing out your eyebrows i've really got to sort my eyebrows out they're quite bushy <laughs> right so we're just going to go on with a quick look with palette one so i'm using palette one today guys so we're just going to get some brushes again i haven't cleaned my brushes out naughty 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 so let me just give my brushes where's my other brush i'm talking about skip that one let's just leave that one there let's just give look at them from the other day i didn't clean them out bad woman bad woman so i'm just going to use my brush cleaner and a tissue just to clean them up and then we'll go on with a look. Now, the other thing I haven't done, which I always do, we are going to use the 4D tick again today, guys. So I'm just going to pop that down there just to warm up, which won't take long with my body temperature at the moment because I'm a bit warm. So we're going to go and use palette number one, which has got loads of browns and bronzes. So this is warm shades of brown. Let me just double check. Because I can never remember. Uh, warm shades of peach peachy brown colours so we're going to use that so we're just going to go on cheekily with sincere as a transition so we're just going to go in my transition just to give me a bit of colour so we're just going to do a quite a neutral eye today as I said it's quite late and I don't want to hold you guys So what have you been up to today, guys? What sort of uh, things have you been up to today? Have you uh, ventured out? Is it too warm for you or it's just right? Have you got sunshine where you are? Let us know in the comments, guys. Let us know what you are up to. So as you can see, just a neutral colour, basically just to give me a little bit of colour there. Just to give me a little highlight. Then we're going to use the crease brush and I think we're going to go in with Chipper. Let's use Chipper. So this is Chipper, this one here. We're just going to work this in, just cornering up into the crease. To darken that out a little bit as I said this is going to be a quite quick oi colour so if you want to know about the spray foundation or any of the products that we use guys just drop a, a little message down and I will get back to you um, I will also put I didn't do it but I will also put a link to the uh, on top of this video um, for the beauty box because if you've seen our beauty box guys it's 69 pound for over 350 retail value of products and you're going to get a 20 pound y cash on your account the moment you join and you're going to have savings of 20 to 25 percent on all future uh, orders that you place through your website but that box is just amazing guys all that amount of makeup for 300 oh, for 69 pound worth over 350 so if you want to know about our beauty box then please let us know so i spent most of the day stripping well i didn't strip a lot of the beds the boys my boys did their beds but i spent most of the day clearing up and stripping beds and uh, running errands that i needed to do because time has got away from me which is a uh, annoying when that happens <laughs> okay so that's chipper now in my inner corner just to give me a little bit more color so i don't look so washed out now do i so hopefully i don't you'll let me know in the comments whether i look washed out or not <laughs> it's a funny day today because it's the middle of the week and it really is a funny day isn't it because it just <sighs> i know people call it hump day but today i just it just the time's just gone so quick today just don't know where the time's gone it's just a, a nightmare that the time goes so fast okay so we have used sincere and chipper 
so far to create them and then I'm just going to use this lighter one it's called brassy and again I'm just going to load my brush up now brassy is quite um glittery and shimmery so I'm just going to pack that on on my inner side of my eyelid so this is going to be quite a pale neutral look because we don't need to go really bold really do we half the time we can go a little bit more subtle now and again so I'm just going to go a little bit lighter cool you guys are quiet today must be out catching all those rays, all those sunshine. Don't blame you. As I say, if you come back and you watch me on the replay, let me know what you've been up to. Put down what you've been up to today, guys. Especially my regulars, because you're very, very quiet today. Let me know what you've been up to. So as you can see, I've just lightened it up now. As I say, I can't see any comments out there. So if you are, if you are on, I can't see any comments. So hopefully you are there. Um, so do check in with me, guys. If you're there, please come and say hi. As I say, if you're watching in the background now, please come and say hi. Just let me know that you are there because I don't think my comments are working. Facebook being a, a killer again, I think. For me. So I'm just going to go back into Chipper a little bit and just darken that area up now because that's all the three colours I'm just going to use. It's just them three. I'm just going to go a little bit darker, just to smell that out a little bit, but not a lot, like that. So as I said, if you've watched me before and um, you enjoy what you want, what you see, if you could sprinkle me around, I would appreciate it. Help me get my business out there guys as i say any of the questions about the foundation or the beauty box please by all means drop me a message down below and i will come back and tell you about it that's better let's give that a little bit more darker and then we'll go back with some more of the brassy in my inner corner just to line that up a little bit more so as i said this is a really quick I look using palette one now as I said the palettes we've got one two and four left all the others have now gone these are now limited edition so once they have stocks have gone they've gone we have got a palette eight eight coming out but I don't know when guys um we have got 15 it's so exciting because we've got 15 new products coming out between next month and the end of the year but what they are, I have no idea, but look at that. Is that not nice? Well, I'm really, <laughs> I'm starting to really boil up in here. It is warm in this uh, room. <sighs> I can tell you that. I need a bit more water. Yeah, I don't seem to see any comments, so I don't know why my comments are not working. So if you are there, hi, <laughs> but I can't see if you have made a comment. It doesn't even seem to be showing up on my tablet, so I don't know why it's going on. Anyway, we'll carry on and say so hopefully you can watch it on the replay. If uh, and I'll you know see the comments on the replay, hopefully, then I can come back and message you because I can't see the comments, they just don't seem to be coming up. Facebook, you're being a killer, <laughs> you're killing my life. Facebook, right? So that's our face. Now, I am going to put just a little bit, I'm going to use a little bit of chipper on my blending brush. And I'm just going to give myself a little bit more colour on my cheeks because one good thing about that spray foundation, guys, it gives you a complete coverage, but you do want to put some other colours back in to give yourself those cheekbones. I'm going to under my chin a little bit just to defy and cover my chin up a bit. And I'll just get another brush and just blend it. So you can use the palette number one for eyeshadow as well as contouring. This is just a quick and easy, lazy way of contouring just to give me a little bit more 
um, contouring on my cheeks so I don't look so flat but can you see how quick and easy that was and now I've got a bit more definition I would put it on my forehead but I've got a little bit on my forehead but I'm getting quite warm in here <laughs> I think I'm gonna have to put a fan in here if I'm gonna do this in the summer months if it gets like this I ain't gonna lie, it's a bit warm in here, but I'm not gonna complain. It's a nice weather. It's better than being um, cold and wet, which is absolutely horrible. I don't like being cold and wet anyway. So as you can see, I'm just blending that out. So now I've got a little bit more colour. So hopefully you can see that as well. Just blend that in. And that's giving me a bit more colour. Right, so we can now go on with our eyelashes. I still can't show you the eye primer, guys, because the eye primer is still out of stock, so I'm not going to tease you with the eye primer. But I am going to brush through my lashes. Because at the end of the day, they are hair, so we need to look after them. But as soon as that primer is back in stock, I will be showing that to you all the time because I love the primer. So I'm going to use the 4D again because I love the 4D. So the 4D, this is just a quick and easy face. So the 4D, the um, palette number one, Addiction palette, which has got those these lovely colours, guys, which all complement one each other. These are going to take you to your old people's home, these palettes, because you use very little of them. They're very highly pigmented. If I come in closer, look at them. Hopefully you can see the three colours that I've used, which are really nice and complement one another. It's really good. Um, as I said, if you want to get on the foundation um, pre-launch, then uh, not pre-launch, pre-list, because it comes back in stock, um, then please put that in. But as I said, anything I've spoken about, guys, um, I feel a bit awkward because I know I've got no comments coming up. It's just quite weird that there's nobody there. It's just oh, emptiness, eerie. It's do 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 do. Bit of a twilight zone going on, I think, because I've got no comments coming up. I can see numbers in the box. But no comments, so it doesn't even show me who's watching, so I don't know what's going on with Facebook. But hopefully it will sort itself out. Okay, so if you see me use the 4D, I've always spoke about the, the you know, the Epic. If you want to have lashes that you just put on and go, then use the Epic. The Epic does a brilliant job as well, guys. But the 4D just gives you that little bit more wow factor because it thickens and it lengthens your lashes. So if you are wanting to have thicker fuller lashes but don't want to wear extensions don't want to have um forces on then give this a go now all our products come with a full tip with a love it uh guarantee which is a full refund up to 14 days so you're not stuck with anything um all the range between you know for our skincare as well again if you want the skincare help with the skincare because i've always said if you want your game face to be a 10 uh, your makeup to be a 10 then you need to up your um, skincare to match otherwise you're not going to get the desired look that you are hoping for but as I said if you want to um, know about our skincare but as I said everything we sell everything that you purchase from us um, comes with a love it guarantee up to 14 days for full refund up to 90 days for a credit refund and every item that you purchase, 10% of that item goes to the foundation to help survivors of child, adolescent sexual abuse. So you're not just buying any mascara or um, any foundation and it's just lining that fat corporate pocket. It is going to help um, survivors of child and adolescent sexual abuse, which is really good. So I hope that helps you guys because it's really close to my heart okay so we've got no one talking so this feels really weird because i can't see anybody there which is quite eerie so i'm going to go on and do my mascara now when i do my mascara but i use the the 4d do i use the epic i still do roughly the same but i just feel that this one takes a little bit more time and effort to get the desired result we want so i take it out slowly and then i basically scrape off every excess because this wand holds so much on the bristles that I don't want to flood my itty bitty little lashes because you can see my lashes are not very very long. I use the lash serum so they are longer than they used to be but they're still tiny compared to most people who have longer lashes than me. So if you have longer lashes than me you're going to get an even more wow factor and I'd be really jealous but 
you know, I can't help with what I've got. So this, excuse me, this is going to um, thicken and lengthen my lashes. So this is how I put it on. There is a technique to wiggle and rotate the wand. I have trouble doing that, so I like to wiggle and basically blink. So if I go quiet, I apologise, but I just don't want to poke myself in the eye. So this is how I put my mascara on. You find your way of putting your mascara on. So I like to just get right in my root line, wiggle and blink. As I said, take your time and you will see the benefits of taking your time with this mascara because it is well worth it, guys. It is the best. Now, this baby has been out for over a year now. It basically broke the internet when it was launched in May of 2019. We completely sold out of all our stock throughout all our markets worldwide within three hours of it launching. We won an award for it for the uh, newest product launch. So it really has held its own. So I've now got the in the bottom and I'm now just rotating that wand to build my lashes up. Now this is fibre infused, so it's going to interlock the fibres with each other, especially if you don't put it on your eyebrow, Pauline. <laughs> Just give me a spoonie and wipe that off before it sets. <laughs> Making a mess of it today, because you guys are not here to help me, and that's what it is. It's kind of quiet. So, but it's fibre infused. It's a one-step fibre mascara. It's splash-proof, not waterproof, but you can waterproof it by going over with Waterproof Epic. But it will give you thicker and fuller, longer lashes. Now you can apply as many coats as you as you desire to get length and volume that you want you want on your lashes. Now this is just sort of like one thinnish coat, really, not a lot on there. But I'm hoping you guys can see the difference that it makes to my lashes. So you've got nothing to lose and everything to gain by trying this, guys. As I said, it comes with a lovely guarantee. So if, if you don't like it or for whatever reason, you can send it back for a full refund. You ain't going to be stuck with it if you don't like it. Now, we used to have a free... D mascara, which was two wand application. This one is so much better because you don't have to use the two wands. And it's all in one. The only thing I would say is don't ever pump it because it is a non-drying formula. So you wouldn't want to pump the tube to get it out because you're just pushing air into the tube that will dry it out. Plus the fact you're pushing um bacteria into that wand um, and from you know from the wand to the tube and the bacteria is going to sit there and grow and you don't want that so never pump your mascara and if you use your mascaras for four to five times a week then the recommendation is three months and then you open a new tube because you wouldn't want to risk eye infections and things from having the bacteria build up in your tube and give you eye infections. I know I wouldn't. And I know we've all been guilty of it. I put my hand up <laughs> until I started uh, doing the makeup again. I did have the same mascara that I used for years, but I only put it on about once in a blue moon, but I still had the same tube of mascara, which is naughty. But not anymore. Okay. Now I'm just going to wipe all that back off. 
and then close the tube back up. Now I'm going to comb through my lashes and then I'm going to do it again and put a second coat on just to show you guys that you can build this up to your desired look. And I've used the lash comb simply because my hair on my head is very, very thin and fly away. And I feel that my eyelashes are the same. So I like to use the lash comb just to help my lashes by pushing them up. So when I use it for the second time, I do exactly the same as I did the first time. And I pull it out and then I wipe off all the excess because I just feel that my lashes don't need to be overloaded. And this stops, stops me getting any chance of any clumping. Because if you don't over, if you don't flood your lashes with too much of the product on the wand, then it's not going to clump, and you're not going to get lumpy bits in your mascara. So as I said, you put it on how you feel you want to put it on, and you can build and build, build until you have got the ideal length and volume that you want. So when I do the second and third coat, I don't go right down into my waterline again because we've already done that. And I just concentrate on the middle to the tips of my lashes now. And try and rotate the wand through my lashes and build the mascara up. Because this is totally buildable, guys. So you can build it up the desired look and length that you want. So. Okay, so I'll wipe it all back off again. As I say, I'm only going to do two coats, but you can do three, four, whatever you want. Now, I have noticed I've got a little bit of mascara on my eyelid, which I don't want there. I can just use my little spoolie. Just remove that and then I'm just going to get my lash comb now I'm not going through my lashes I am just giving them a, a push up as I said from my roots to make them curl because my lashes as I said my lashes are so short and straight that I just feel they need a little bit more help so if you wanted the lash comb as well to try with the 4D guys, it is available. But again, the lash comb is limited as well. But look at that. Isn't that not good? Is that not good, good, good? I think it is. <laughs> God, I don't think I can put up with this silence. Hello, can anybody hear me? Hello, hello, hello. I really don't know what's going on with Facebook today. I am live. Yep, yeah, still got the live at the top corner, so I don't know what's going on. And there is my lashes, guys. So I'll just give that a few minutes just to set in its place, just so that when I look up, it's not going to put it all over my eyeshadow because I've already done enough of that but as I say clean it up if you've got a spoolie you can just gently clean it off before it sets up but that's my eyes guys with the 4D and just complete the uh, neutral look I am going to go on I think with a neutral lip gloss if I can find it making a noisy mess so that's all we do to go on with Lux. I don't know whether this is still available on the website guys so I do apologise if it isn't but I'm just going to use a bit of Lux on my eyelashes. Just to give my lips a little bit of moisture and a bit of colour. And our lip glosses, guys, do not go sticky either. But that is my look today, guys, using 
palette number one which is warm peachy tones which is still available on our website as I said they're limited edition so they are not going to hang around for long position eyeline pencil are 4d we have used the spray foundation in organza and we have used the hydrating primer so they are the products that i've used to create my look for today so i hope you have enjoyed as i say it's been really quiet i don't know what happening my comments don't seem to be working so hopefully you are there but as i said if you have not seen me before my name is pauline rogers and i am the face behind beauty for you so if you have enjoyed this video and it resonates with you then press anywhere on the screen press follow and if you um like to sprinkle me around and put me on your wall or anywhere else on facebook that you are in i would really be very grateful and if you could put back and say that you have sprinkled this video so that i can come and chat to you and say thank you for sprinkling me and also to talk about setting you up an award a link so that you can earn yourself some free product credit and this month if your rewards link qualifies you could bag yourself a pair of earrings and a free waterproof mascara so it's really exciting to be able to do so that's my look for today look at those eyelashes guys i hope you can see what i see <laughs> so that's my look for today guys so as I said, I don't know what's going on. I don't, I've got numbers up. It, I can see numbers up on the live uh, box, but no comments are coming through. So I hope if you have um, put a comment and I haven't um, answered you, I'm not being rude. I just can't see any comments today. I don't know what's going on. And um, that's basically it, guys. But as I said, if you want to get on my pre-order list, because this baby comes back in stock on Friday at 5 p.m. on our website, so you can queue up and get it yourself if you want to, but if you would want me to do the hassle for you and queue up and get you this, then jump on my pre-order list, guys, and just put uh, spray foundation in the comments and I will come back and get you and sort you out your pre-order. And if you need a colour match for any of our foundations, including this one, then put colour match in the comments and I will also come and colour match you as well. So that's it for day 20 of my 31 days live i missed a day yesterday because it was 19 and it was my son's birthday so i didn't come live um but yeah so day 20 of my 31 days live i hope you've enjoyed it hope you've enjoyed the look that i've created using uh, palette number one as i said limited edition palette with these shades so i have used this one here which is sincere the one next to it brassy and the one next to it, Chipper. So I've used just these three shades here to create my eye look. And I've used the Position Eyebrow Pencil for my eyebrows, 4D for my mascara, and I've also used Chipper to give me some contour on my cheeks. So that's it for today, guys. So I hope you've enjoyed it. As I said, if you can sprinkle me around, I apologise if I have not answered any of your questions or I haven't seen any of your comments come up, but I don't seem to think my comments are working, so I'm not sure what's going on there. But I will be back tomorrow. And um, so enjoy the rest of your Wednesday. Enjoy the sunshine. And um, I'll catch you tomorrow. Thanks for tuning in, guys. All take care. Bye.